What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Call of Duty Modern Warfare. And today Infinity Ward and Activision had a big announcement and they did announce that the game will have a battle pass style system and they stated there will never ever be loot boxes or any type of loot box system within their game. Now this is a massive announcement saying there's not going to be any loot boxes or anything like that in Call of Duty because loot boxes supply drops have been in the game forever. Them stating there will be no loot boxes or supply drops in Call of Duty or Modern Warfare ever is a pretty big statement. And that's going to be kind of a hard statement to go back on. You know, a few days ago I made a video when the art director had leaked that, or had, you know, stated that there was going to be, there was not going to be any, or there wasn't any kind of system being worked on at the time. There were going to be no loot boxes or supply drops. A lot of people kind of, including myself, thought, well, they might not be working on it right now, but five to six months down the road, we'll see some kind of loot drop system. Now that they have stated there will not be any system like this in the game ever, that is pretty interesting in my opinion, and I think a good thing as well. I will link all this information down in the description below if you guys would like to read over it for yourself. But they kind of did state how they're going to be working with this new system. It says introducing a new battle pass system, not a loot box system, uh, not a loot box system. All functional content that has an impact on game balance, such as base weapons and attachments, will be unlocked by simply playing the game. The new Battle Pass system will allow players to see content that they are earning or buying. Battle Pass will launch uh, with timed and new and post-launch live seasons so you can unlock cool new Modern Warfare themed content that matches each season. With the new Battle Pass system, players will be able to earn COD points by playing the game. There will both be a free stream and a premium stream of content in the Battle Pass and Modern Warfare. New base weapons will be earned through gameplay simply by playing Modern Warfare. Functional attachments or base weapons can be unlocked through the gameplay as well, just like in the beta. I think that's some big news there, saying that new base weapons will be earned through gameplay. So it sounds like every weapon that is added post-launch will be able to just be earned by playing and not have to be earned through some kind of loot box system, which is a great thing in my opinion. The Battle Pass will, uh, also will have an in-game store that will feature a variety of cosmetic content that does not impact game balance. They did state it will not be available at launch. Of course, they're going to be working on, you know, first few days or weeks like bugs and, and making sure launch week and weekend goes goes well. And I'm sure we'll probably see this battle pass system in the following weeks after the game is out. Like I said, I'm going to link this down in the description below so you can read over it. It's a lot of information and it's a, a pretty good read if you guys have the time to read it. But I was really surprised at this. I'm kind of glad they're going with a battle pass system. This is going to be something like you see traditionally in a lot of games now, a lot of free-to-play games. Most people have played Fortnite, so you all know how Fortnite works. You have a battle pass that you know has some free things you can get, and then there's also a, a premium battle pass, kind of like they're doing with Call of Duty here, that you can purchase, and you can unlock a stream of other content as well. Now, the Call of Duty or Modern Warfare or none of it was really stated by Infinity Ward or anybody that what the price would be for that premium you know content. Fortnite's, I think, is around $10. Some games are around $15. Bucks. just depends on the game. But $10 to $15 bucks for a season pass or, you know, a battle pass year in or, you know, month to month, you know, every few months is not really that big a deal to me. It'll be a lot cheaper than having to buy hundreds of dollars worth of loot boxes if you're, you know, someone that buys loot boxes and you're trying to get certain things out of it and you have to go t drop tons of money. This will be a lot cheaper system. Also, it's going to make Activision money because a lot of people are going to earn that currency through that battle pass and they're going to spend that in the store. So they're going to have to turn around anyway and buy the new battle pass the next season that it is released. So I think this is going to be a lot better. I think they have finally listened to the community and it's not just Call of Duty that has an issue with loot boxes. A lot of games do and I'm hoping that just game developers in general start going in this direction and getting rid of the loot box system altogether because... You can spend lots of money and never really get what you need, and it's just a waste in, in a lot of people's opinion. So hopefully this new system will work out well. It does sound good, and I'm still skeptical because I've heard Activision states things for so many games, Treyarch states things for so many games, Infinity Ward as well. So I'm going to have a little bit of skepticism still, you know, kind of going forward. But right now it does seem like we're going to have a better system this year than the normal loot box or you know, anything like that where you're having to buy tons of stuff or having to just get on and get that RNG luck when you open a case. Guys, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this new Battle Pass system. Are you happy with it? And of course, guys, if you like this video, make sure you hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. Make sure you click that bell icon up in the top right corner so you know when all my videos go live. And also, if you have the time, make sure you can share this video. Sharing the videos help out just like subscribers and likes and views 
sharing videos helps uh, the channel out a lot as well. So I would appreciate that also. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.